Hey everyone, I delayed Fab Wednesdays for this presentation here. On Wednesday at RCIA, I was presented the Creed at the Basilica. And then at the RCIA that I go to at St. Teresa's, I received a Creed as well. But the difference between the two Creeds is that at the Basilica, I got the Nicene Creed. And at St. Teresa's, I got the Apostles Creed. Lucky me, I have to actually memorize both creeds. What's great about these creeds is that, like Father Jim says, knowing what you believe in sets the direction of your life and where you go and how you act. So I thought I only had to memorize the Lord's Prayer, but then I had to memorize the Hail Mary, and now I have to memorize the creeds. There's so many things that you have to memorize, but they're good memorizations. And what's great is that if somebody ever asks me what do Christians believe in, what do Catholics believe in, I can just say the creed. And that pretty much sums it up, which is excellent because I always was like, uh, well, we believe in God and I believe in the Bible. But now I have something concrete to say and something that was passed down by the apostles, the first followers of Jesus. So here's some footage from the presentation of the Creed at St. Joseph Basilica. Listen carefully to the words of the faith by which you will be justified. The words are few but the mysteries they contain are great. Receive them with a sincere heart and be faithful to them. Dear friends, you have heard the words professing the faith that you will become a part of at the Easter sacraments. And I'll close you off with the presentation of the Creed at St. Teresa's. Thanks for watching. God bless. And you know, if these catechists ever say, well, what have you learned? Just recite the Creed to them. Because, my friends, that is the synopsis of what it is and who it is we are as Roman Catholics, as Christians. This is what we believe. You know, each line is a summation of what we believe as Catholics. Some of that stuff, folks, is, is not that apprehendable. It's, it's, it takes a leap of faith to accept it. I believe in God, Father Almighty, Creator and Earth, and in Jesus Christ, His only Son, our Lord, who was conceived by the Holy Spirit, born of the Virgin Mary, suffered under Pontius Pilate, was crucified and died.